Good morning guys, you join me on a hot day and I have a sunburnt nose and sunburnt forehead um, and I am currently, as I'm filming this, 37 weeks pregnant. I'm not sure when this video is going up so I may have already had the baby by the time you see this. Um, but today is just a day of me trying to survive being pregnant in this heat so I'm just going to show you everything I eat and drink and what I'm doing and it's just going to be like a day in the life but look how sunburnt my nose is so guys remember put SPF on underneath your makeup so you don't look like Rudolph okay so you join me making a get this baby out of me smoothie so basically I've got some raspberry leaf tea that I brewed yesterday and put in the fridge to cool down and some frozen pineapple both are apparently supposed to be natural ways of inducing labor and um, if you watched my last pregnancy update um, I did mention that they're offering me a sweep at 38 weeks I'm now 37 plus 3 so just trying to you know give my body a little push to a uh, move its way along because I cannot stand this heat. I'm also just sticking in some watermelon and three strawberries that look like they're about to turn. Um, not sinning the smoothies, like I said in my previous videos, I've not been sinning them since I've been pregnant. Um, but obviously, if you make a smoothie and you want to sin it, then just sin it accordingly. I'm also drinking some water as well because it is very hot as you can see I've got the fan on and this retro foot spa was from Jack's Nan for me to use because if you can see my feet are really swollen I've got like sausage toes and cankles the joys of pregnancy Okay, so it's a couple of hours since I had that smoothie, um, but I'm feeling really hungry now. Um, I have been up since like six o'clock I woke up. Um, I had the smoothie about eight, it's now about 10-ish. So I'm having a bowl of cereal, which I will show you. So this is 40 grams of Cheerios with um, Hex A milk and then some frozen berries as well because it's really hot. So I just chucked some frozen berries in there and this is sort of like my second breakfast slash brunch, but I need it. Okay, so I've made the decision to not put makeup on today, simply because this sunburn seems to be getting <laughs> gradually redder. So I'm just gonna moisturize my face and not have any makeup on. I'm not going out anywhere today, I've decided. Um, so I'm just now sat on my exercise ball, um, just having a little bounce and a little wiggle, because, you know, Every little helps trying to get baby down into position ready for this sweep on Friday um, because I have read that it'll, the sweep will only work if the baby is ready to come out so obviously with the raspberry leaf tea and the birthing ball and the pineapple and everything I'm obviously not trying to put myself into labor like today um, I'm just trying to make sure that we're like as ready as possible ready for the sweep on Friday if I choose to take it I still might change my mind and wait until 40 weeks but they have said that I can have it at 38, so I'm just trying to make sure that if I do decide to have it, I'm as ready as possible. Okay, so I've decided to put some of this Nip and Fab Kale Fix Moisturiser on my face to try and help um, moisturise the sunburn and help it hurt a little bit less. Um, I've used this moisturiser before and it's really, really good. I have linked it down below, um, but yeah, hopefully this is going to help my skin Okay, here I am looking all greasy and shiny, but hopefully that's gonna help. Oh, it's really sore. 
Okay, so this is the um, editing setup that I've got going on. Um, I've got birthing ball, which I'm going to be sat on, laptop patched on there, in front of the window, which is open, and then I've got the fan on as well. Um, and then I've got my foot spa over there, just in case I decide I need to dunk my feet in some cold water. And then obviously I've got some water here as well. It's lunch time um, and I made up some chicken soups um, the other day because I bought a whole chicken for £2.50 on yellow sticker um, and I've got loads of meat that I need to do something with but I did also make some soups so I've frozen some and then I had some in the fridge so even though it's really hot I'm going to have a soup um, because it's yummy and they need to be eaten. So here is the chicken soup um, and this little bowl thing is like a hand-me-down from my dad when we moved in um, but yeah this just has in it some of the chicken from the whole chicken that I cooked it's also got carrot, celery, onion, sweet corn, um, peas, a potato um, the stock was made from the chicken carcass um, and the leftover vegetables and everything very tasty gonna eat this now and it's sin free in case you were wondering. I am literally so hungry today so I'm gonna have a banana um, just to keep me going until the next time that I eat. Okay I'm going in with another snack and this is one of the one and a half sin ice lollies that you will have seen in my five under five video. I just need something to cool me down so I'm hoping this is gonna help. Okay, so for dinner I have made some Cajun chicken, um, which is just some of the chicken that I had left over that I mentioned um, from that whole chicken that I bought, mixed with peppers, onion, Cajun spice, some tomato puree and a little bit of cheese, um, which would come out of your healthy extra allowance. And then I've got some salad here and then some new potatoes that were boiled and then roasted in the oven in fry light, salt and pepper. Okay, I'm having a four and a half sin choc ice which isn't in focus for my pudding so once again i haven't finished the vlog on the day that i was filming it um but basically after the choc ice i didn't eat anything else i did drink more water because it is very 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 hot at the moment the week that i'm filming this video it is like 30 degrees so very hot hence all the ice lollies and everything um but yeah that's everything from me for this video if you enjoy these kind of videos the what I eat in a day kind of things then please do give me a thumbs up leave your comments down below and don't forget to hit subscribe so you don't miss out on my next video as you can see the sunburn is slightly less red today but I do have BB cream on so it's kind of toned it down a little bit <laughs> yeah lesson learned make sure you wear SPF in the sunshine under your makeup bye yeah.